Hey University TV watchers, I'm Chloe here on campus at Tennessee Wesleyan College, home of the Bulldogs. Let's kick off our tour. Tennessee Wesleyan College is in Athens, Tennessee and is centrally located between historic Chattanooga and the Great Smoky Mountains. Athens is rich in tradition, holding annual festivals for locals and students to enjoy, which include Moo Fest, Pumpkin Town, and the old-fashioned downtown Christmas celebration. I just think like how friendly our city is, like everybody is open to anybody and everybody just kind of knows everybody and it's just like really... You don't get that many places. Tennessee Wesleyan's lush 40 acres feature a park-like setting and over 20 buildings featuring historic 1800s architecture. TWC enrolls over 1,000 students with a student-to-faculty ratio of 16 to 1. Females make up 63% of the freshman class, leaving 37% to the men. I came in, you know, not knowing what I was going to do with my life, not knowing where exactly I was going to go in the world, but I knew I was um, on my way and the support here and my friends here and what I learned about myself, um, I've become the person I am now and I attribute that to here. To gain entrance into Tennessee Wesleyan, the minimum requirement for an incoming freshman is an 18 on the ACT, 870 on the SAT, and a 2.25 high school GPA. Tuition costs for Wesleyan students is about $18,000 per year, plus fees which will run you an extra $600. TWC offers four undergrad degrees in over 30 majors and concentrations. The most popular majors among students include exercise and sports sciences, behavioral sciences, education, and nursing. I try to try to find any way I can to um, relate the information to the students' everyday life, uh, especially with difficult topics. Most of the classes here do a hands-on approach. You're always involved in some type of project. They'll bring outside speakers in to talk to your class. You'll do projects with outside groups or organizations. So you're always involved in something and you're not just sitting in a classroom reading a textbook. The Fort Sanders Nursing Department at the Knoxville campus provides a combination of excellence in nursing education as well as a quality liberal arts curriculum. The areas really understand that when we recommend a student, for example, an internship or just a part-time job, that it's somebody that we believe in. And so those students have very easy access to shadowing opportunities, internship opportunities, or actual paying jobs to get in and look at specific careers and help them decide if it's, if it's what they really want. A lot of those contacts are made through our pre-professional seminar, which is a, a course that allows students to explore uh, the profession they think they're interested in. We bring in professionals from the community in that class to talk with our students and to talk with them about the good and the bad and, and to explain uh, what it took for them to get to where they are. And so, so that's a really good experience for our students. Tennessee Wesleyan's 47 full-time faculty members are some of the top in their field and are committed to giving students personal attention. 77% of faculty have a doctorate or terminal degree with higher percentages in various areas of study. We have a caring faculty that you know will meet one-on-one -on -one with them as much as it will take to introduce them or to help them along the way once they do discover that. I spend a lot of time with students outside of class um, and in class means that when they come for say a letter of reference when they need a job or a letter of reference when they're applying to professional school um, I know them, they know me, and um, I can give them an honest answer. 18 men's and women's Bulldog athletic teams compete at the NCAA Division II level in the NAIA and the Appalachian Athletic Conference. The Bulldog tradition is that of excellence in athletics and academics. In the past decade, the school has racked up eight All-Americans, 15 All-American scholars, 24 conference titles, four regional titles, and 10 national championship appearances. TWC Housing offers four residence halls and 65% of first-time students choose to live on campus. Options range from suites to apartment style to new state-of-the-art living choices. I don't think it gets better than living on campus. Whether you're bored, you wanna watch a movie, it's late at night, you just want someone to hang out with, and especially I think it's great for the classroom as well because there's always someone accessible that is in that class with you or has had that class the year before you. Um, and we just have lots of fun, lots of help, and lots of support can come from living on campus. I'm on SGA so far and this year we've already admitted, I believe, four new organizations to our roster. We have a total of about 40 something clubs and it just keeps growing every day. And there are new clubs and organizations in the works right now. 
music fills the halls of Tennessee Wesleyan. Their concert choir actually performed at Lincoln Center and they've gone overseas to perform for the troops in Germany. Melissa here is performing her very own original piece and I'm very much enjoying it. Back in 1780, a British officer and Nakatula, a member of the Cherokee tribe, fell in love. But a jealous tribesman slayed the officer, and in Romeo and Juliet fashion, Nakatula took her own life. The two were buried together, with seeds from two trees in their hands. Those trees sprouted on this campus, but when one died, the other couldn't live any longer. Legend has it, these statues stand where the lovers are buried. Thanks so much for joining us in Athens, Tennessee at Tennessee Wesleyan College. There's a lot more to see here, so I'm gonna go check it out. And you should too. I'm Chloe with University TV and I'll see you next time. <laughs>